Okay, one thing that I do not like about RV camping and the trailer is when it is dirty, it just feels extra dirty. And because it's so small and it tracks in a lot of dirt differently than a home, it just, I just feel like I feel it more, if that makes sense. Like if I saw a mosquito outside and I came inside, I just like am itchy, even if it's not in here or not on me. I don't know if that might just be a me thing, but all that to say, this thing needs a good <laughs> cleaning after our first trip together. I'm also going to be taking the covers off of the cushions and taking them in to be washed, because they're due. And we're also going to need to take the blankets off. Got some other random laundry here from our trip. See, it's just like a blanket and laundry feels huge here. It's freaking hot right now. Freaking hot. Okay. It's really nice to have clean sheets though. Jesus. Actually feels like wrestling an alligator. Oh my god, it feels better to get these daggone sheets off. Oh, that feels better. Okay, we're back at the Black Series. I'm feeling more energized. I'm wearing my nice bright colors because I'm gonna brighten it up for summer in here. I have clean sheets for the bed. I did not get around to washing the couch covers because life is chaotic right now. When I left here, I had three kids to take care of, wanted to be present with them. I like the couch cushions as is, so I'm not gonna stress about that. I'm going to put the new sheets on the bed. First, I'm gonna vacuum all that stinking pompous flower stuff off of the side and then I'll be back. By the way, this is just like a little shark handheld vacuum. I use it in my house on my kitchen counters and my fridge. And now it usually just comes here. This is like the stuff that like space wise you don't think about, but like just moving blankets to change the sheets and then lifting the mattress. It just is like not a lot of space to move around. So I definitely prefer to do this when the kids are not here because when the kids are here, it's like impossible sometimes. I don't even know, like this is just for decoration for content, you guys, this picture, because I can't think of anywhere for it to go yet. So right now it's just kind of there. And I just grabbed whatever clean queen size bed sheet I had. It's from the company store. There was a dead bug, which is disgusting. Well, that is gonna give me nightmares, so that's wonderful. <laughs> I hate changing these sheets. Exhausted. See, now I'm all itchy because I saw that bug. These sheets are also from the company store. And then I'm also just putting like every random little thing the kids have left in here on a trip in this bag. Oh, our White House bag 
from when we went to the White House Easter egg roll. My fair cane, I've been looking for this. This is a random side note. If you are somebody who carries pain right here, it's like the best thing ever. I'm taking it to work tonight. Now I will vacuum down in this disgusting corner. Okay, so honestly, I feel huge weight lifted. This area I'm excited about first. I'm just gonna clean it off, do a nice wipe of the counters, and then I don't know if this is gonna work, but I had an idea to like brighten it up and make it fun and colorful for summertime that's not permanent or anything like that. So let's do it. love wipes. I actually love the Windex wipes too, which is normally what I would have. Oh my gosh, you guys, my allergies are going to be crazy the rest of this video. Look how dirty. Look how dirty. I'm telling you, RVs are just another kind of dirty, especially with like the windows open and fresh air blowing in. Look. <laughs> doing the dishes because the stink in the camera stopped recording. There was a tick on my shoulder. I don't want to like think about bugs on me or tick on me. I don't want to think about a tick on the kids. Handsome had a tick on him when we drove away from the last RV site. So I'm like, are ticks just everywhere? Are there ticks in here? That is the thing about summertime that's different than wintertime, the freaking bugs. So I'm gonna research some bug stuff. And as a matter of fact, when I was looking at the bug spray, there was one that had pair, pre-cord, paracord, Kind of like the same thing that's in my dog's flea and tick medicine. And I don't know why, I didn't get it. I was like, I don't need this one. I'm gonna get the regular one. Here's the thing about me, when I start feeling itchy, and I start thinking about bugs, it's not gonna go away. So I'm gonna try to hurry up and do what I need to do and then get out of here and figure out the bug situation because I'm gonna research Lyme disease until I'm like green in the face. Oh my God, that's not a good. Okay, I just looked at it, it was a lone star tick. So that's what it was. So I'm gonna hurry up and clean and get out of here. I'm also going to keep my body covered. I don't want a tick on me again. But anyhow, I got a few things from Michaels because they had a 50% off summer decor savings going on. Plus I have a military discount at Michael's and a 20% off coupon. Oh my God, my arm hurts where I got bit by that tick. I don't know if it's in my head. It feels like I got a flu shot. Is that okay? I have an idea of how I want to put these up. I don't know if it's gonna look great or not. I'm just gonna give it a try just for fun. The two things I got to help, obviously I love command hooks. So I got some more of these heavy duty ones from the frame department and the Scotch mount double-sided extreme indoor outdoor mounting tape. So I know for sure, oh, here comes the jets. So I'll just put this on right now. Oh my gosh, this is not what I wanted, is it? It's the Velcro kind. I did not pay attention when I bought these. We'll see, it might work. But in the meantime, we have this, so we'll try it. Right here. Again, to be clear, I do not know if this is gonna look good. I know it works because I tested one. I just don't know if it's going to be visually pleasing, if that makes sense. Okay, I'm gonna get this tape on and not run down my battery and my camera, and then I'll be back to show you. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is just line this up at the bottom and press. And honestly, I forgot that that was gonna just open up, which is fine because that's what we wanted to do, right? So. This is nice because it doesn't get in the way. If I want to open the cabinet, I just press. Might as well go ahead and press it. Yellow. Just 
for a little pop of summer okay i kind of do like that i didn't think that i would so ideally i wanted three of that orange terracotta color but they were sold out that's fun look at me with these cute ideas what they also had was this shelf i can put some putty down on it to help it stay this right here i thought was like a rainbow but it's not a rainbow see that's the bottom it's a candle and if you put it this way because it's not completely arched it kind of just looks like a thigh gap maybe that's like good and contrasting to arches i don't know i do not know how to style shelves then i also got this little guy and i was just gonna add that here oh my god what a cute little happy sunny corner until i get the tile that i'm gonna put over here which will probably be when i change out the summer stuff i just want to cover that up these are just placemats that i feel like i can just kind of cover up like that just a little something, something. I'm going to try to be kind to myself when I say this. I don't love it. I don't love it. In my head and in Michael's, it was going to look a little bit differently, but it's fine. It's still fun for summer. Sometimes things just look better in your head than they do on. I do like these until I get the tiles. I think it's this yellow throwing it off. See, like, it's fine. It's that yellow. The thing is, we know it works, right? At least we have that established. So if you do see arches or you feel inspired to put a temporary decoration, temporary decor on your Black Series cabinets, you can make arches like these very easily. I'm going to look online and see if I can find something that's a little bit more palatable for what I'm going for and I can't do a video about summertime in the black series without mentioning make sure that you check and restock your SPF bug spray which I'm gonna look into that one with the tick protection as well because now I'm seriously gonna be itchy all day and then also just like a lotion I say that because a lot of times we remember the sunscreen but aloe vera and moisturizing after the sun is also important so just make sure if you are planning any family travel or for yourself, restock sunscreen, bug spray, and lotion. <laughs>